guys, I'm excited for today's video because I have a subscription box unboxing from Look Fantastic. This is the third month that I have been sent one of their boxes to feature and I'm so excited about it. I haven't had a subscription box in a long time, so this is super fun for me. And I will have my playlist linked up in the card so you guys can see all of the products I received in three months of the Look Fantastic Beauty Box. So it can help you guys make the decision about whether you want to sign up or not. If you do want to sign up, please use my link down below and you can get your first box for $1 with a annual subscription purchase, which I think is fantastic. You get six products in each box and the boxes are so nice. My first month they had it in this really nice makeup bag. And then last month and this month from these really nice boxes that I'm keeping. Like I'm a crazy person, I'm keeping these. They're so cute. So without further ado, let's get in. I have not looked inside. I do know one of the products because in these boxes, it also includes a little pamphlet and in the back of it, it tells you one of the items that will be in the upcoming box. This is a true unboxing. So the pamphlet's on top. I will go over that at the end. I don't want to spoil any products. So just going to grab and go. So the first thing is the CVR, oh no, Palpabral Cream, P-A-L-P-E-B-R-A-L. Hyaluronic acid and omega-3, 6, and 9. It is irritated eyelids, anti-itching, soothing cream. That's interesting. I definitely want to see what the booklet says about that. We will see. We will see. I, I do have itchy eyes sometimes because I have very sensitive eyes. I wear contacts. And especially when I'm filming two videos in one day, even if, you know, I try to leave some time in between, my eyes feel so sensitive. So mad props to everyone out there like Vac Roche so that does eye swatches. I can't imagine. The next product is the Ameliorate Smoothing Body Exfoliant. It is an intensive hydrating retexturizer, which sounds so good. If you guys watch my sample project pan, I'm working on a product right now that I'm almost done with. And I really like using this on the KP on my arms and also on my stretch marks. So this will be great and it's a really nice size. So we'll get into the details in a minute. So I'm hoping for some makeup here. Okay, nice, whoops, oh no. I didn't mean to open it, okay. So this is, oh no, I can't tell the brand from the logo. So it will say in the book, this is a 575, the color pen eyeliner. And it is a brown felt tip liquid liner, which is nice. I love how long and skinny it is. And I actually have been enjoying brown liner this year. And I can't wait to see whether this transfers on me because I've been having a lot of issues with transferring and bleeding. So it's exciting to get a makeup item. That's definitely my favorite part in any box. Next, we have the Beauty Pro Brightening Sheet Mask. It's an anti-aging formula, so that'll be great for my sample project pan as well. In my sample project pan for this month, I did throw in one of the products that I got in my July box. Oh, okay, this is the thing I knew about. I'm definitely the most, well, I haven't seen everything yet, but I am excited about this. This is the... It doesn't have any more writing on it, but it's like the By Terry Rose Lip Balm. And By Terry is such an expensive brand. And I don't even typically love the scent of rose. Let me see how strong the scent is. Mm, it's pretty strong. So we'll see if it bothers me or not, but oh, it's such a luxurious product. That's very exciting to me. Okay. I know there's something else in here. I'm feeling around. Let me see how many of those. One, two, three, four, five. Okay, I think this is the last product. Oh, okay, Christoph Robin. I've tried something from them from Sephora before. This is an hydrating melting mask. It's for hair. With aloe vera for hydrated hair, which is great. This is a good size as well. I can always use a hair mask because they have really dry ends. And I think that's everything. Let me just double check the box. Yes, those are all six of my products. We have two makeup products one for body 
one for hair, one for skin, and I think this is an eye cream, but it also sounds like a treatment product. So a nice little mix there. So going into our booklet, which looks like this, so pretty. What you have would be a list of the things that are in the box. So now I'm just gonna go through the products one by one to give you some more information from the book, starting with the Amalurate Smoothing Body Exfoliant. It says this is specifically formulated to combat KP. Oh good, that is what, that's what I've got. Oh, that's perfect. The bumpy chicken skin like texture that often shows on the back of arms and legs. This moisturizer is a secret to smooth and supple skin. It has lactic acid, shea butter, and coconut oil. And it says put on dry skin two to three times a week before rinsing in the bath or shower. So I'm very excited to have this. The one I'm using right now is from First Aid Beauty. So I definitely will have to see how this performs and then look at the two price wise, but that's so good. And this comes with 1.6 fluid ounces. So that's a lot of uses, especially if I'm just doing it on my arms. If I'm applying it on my stretch marks, it might go a little faster, but that is so great. Next we have the eyeliner and let me see what the brand name is. Oh, three INA. And this is a pigmented, easy to use liquid pen eyeliner that's perfect for achieving a wide range of liner looks from a cat eye to graphic lines with a super fine and flexible precision tip that glides slowly over the eye. It's long lasting, quick drying and smudge free. We'll have to see about that. And just tells you how to put on liquid liner. Most of us know that. Then we have the sheet mask and this is from the brand beauty pro and it is a youth inducing sheet mask and rich with an abundance of anti-aging ingredients that are suitable for all skin types your skin will appear rejuvenated and brighter in just 15 minutes so you're supposed to put this on clean skin leave on for 15 to 20 minutes we'll see about that i have not been too blown away by sheet mask but it's something that's definitely easy to use especially if i leave it out on top of my little like sample drawers instead of putting away where my like skincare backups are if i put it in there it's going to take me a long time to use it but i'm gonna leave it up top and you guys will see that next month or the month after in my sample project pan next we have the christoph robin hydrating melting mask with aloe vera this is an intensive hair mask that's infused with 98 percent natural ingredients to lock in moisture and leave you with luminous locks ideal for dry brittle hair free from parabens and sulfates. It has aloe vera juice and citric acid. And it says to shampoo your hair, then leave this on for 10 minutes before rinsing. So that would be a great time to shave, wash your body and whatnot. And it comes with 1.3 fluid ounces. Again, not too bad, especially for me. I apply conditioner from my ears down. I have a very oily scalp, but very dry end. So this will be very, very nice. And I've tried a couple things from them before so definitely something i would get some good use out of and okay here we have the product that i'm very interested in and a little confused by and this is the cvr palaprobel p-a-l-p-e palpa brow eyelid cream or creamer okay let me try this again this is the SVR Palpa Brow Eyelid Creamer. Wonderful. It is a calm and soothing eye cream that will provide your delicate eye area with up to 24 hours of hydration. Its velvet texture helps to reduce redness and irritation for a more comfortable eye area. And this comes with half a fluid ounce and I feel like that is probably a full size. I guess I should look that up. Um, it doesn't say if these are minis or full sizes, but I think that like, this is a full size, this is a full size, the rest are minis, but this, is, I mean, this has to be a full size. Why would an eye cream be any more than half a fluid ounce? But I'm excited to try that out, like I said, especially when I've worn multiple makeup looks in a day, my eyes can be very irritated, and that sounds very wonderful. And then the last thing we have would be the By Terry Balm de Rose. And this is not the one in a pot, it's the one in the gloss tube, which I definitely prefer that application method. 
This is a nourishing lip balm enriched with By Terry's signature formula that is perfect for softening whilst adding an enviable shine. Apply directly to your lips throughout the day as often as required and you can put it under or over lipstick. It has shea butter, rose flower wax, and vitamin E. So definitely try this out and see how nourishing it is. Then usually they always include some little fun facts about an ingredient, which is awesome for me because I really don't know much about skincare ingredients. This one is about panthenol. So it says what it is and how you use it. Ooh, then they've got a sneak peek for some different versions of beauty boxes they're gonna have for Christmas, oh, an advent calendar. I've always wanted one of those, but they're like, I just haven't made myself get one because they're a little bit pricey and it's something that you really should buy before Christmas, leading up to Christmas. But I've always had advent, aller had advent calendars as a kid with like that crappy chocolate in them and it didn't matter that it was crappy, it was just cool to open something up every day. Oh, that is so fun. Okay, so they're gonna have an advent calendar with 25 products from Kate Somerville, LMS and Shiseido and more. That's very exciting. And you can pre-order it now. And they have a beauty chest with products retailing over $350. And then a festival edit filled with six products that encompass all things Christmas. I can't wait to hear more about that. It's so crazy thinking that Christmas is around the corner. Like I know you guys don't wanna hear that and I don't either. I'm excited just for fall. Then there's a little bit of informa information about the design of the box. Then talking about TikTok trends. And then you have the what's coming up. So what we can look forward to in the October box is the Rituals of Myrrh Body Cream. And it is orange scented. So that sounds very nice. and. If it's the same as the picture, it's 2.3 fluid ounces, which is a good bit for a lotion. And then there are a few limited edition boxes, the Lux Collective and the Neome limited edition box, which sound lovely. The Lux edition has products from Nars, Shiseido, and Laura Mercier, and the Neome limited edition box has hand balms, pillow mist, and candles. So things to just unwind and relax. So that sounds very lovely. So that sounds very nice. And I am very excited about these products. Of course, I would love to see a little bit more like fun makeup, but I know not everyone just wants makeup. So I do think it's nice that for all three months so far, they've done a good job having some makeup, skincare, hair care sometimes, and some body products in there, which I think is great. So again, we have two makeup products two skincare items, a body product, and a hair product. So that is a wonderful mix, and you guys will definitely see a lot of these things, namely these three. And upcoming sample project pans where you will get my in-depth thoughts on the product. So that was my September unboxing for the Look Fantastic Beauty Box. Thank you so much Look Fantastic for sending this to me and let me know if you guys are already signed up or if you plan on signing up for their annual subscription. Again, if you plan on it, please use my link, which will be down below, and you can get your first box for just $1 with a purchase of an annual subscription. So I'm gonna thank you all so much for watching this video. Please like, comment, and subscribe, and I'll talk to you soon. Bye, guys.